If you're new to the channel, welcome. If you've been before, welcome back. So today I'm going to be showing you how to show, uh, set up your Monoprice Mini Delta and print using 4.3 version of Cure. So first thing first, you need to actually go in and uninstall any version of Cure you might have on your computer. So you just go into your uninstall list, I've already done it, and just uninstall any versions you have, all right? From there, you need to make your way into your C drive. And you need to make sure your hidden items is turned on. So make sure that's checked. So go to view and check hidden items. And go to users, your primary folder, mine is Vulkan, um, app data, roaming, and the cure folder you need to delete that so let's go ahead delete on the keyboard and let's delete it now we can go ahead and leave out of there and we're going to download cure all right since i already have it downloaded i'm not going to download it again and close out and then we're going to go to the monoprice mini delta unofficial wiki and we're going to click this profile right here the um the 3.6 and higher i've downloaded this already you just hit download Let's download it and close out of there. And then you're going to download a Benchy of your choice. You can pick whatever you want. I'm just going to be picking this one right here. And since I already have it downloaded, I'm not going to download that again. Now you're going to make your way into your download folder. And I'll have the links to all this in the description below. All right. So now we're going to go ahead and install Cure. All right, now that Cure is installed, you have to run it at least once to create your folder inside of the roaming folder. Okay, I'm going to close up Cure. Now the profile you downloaded, we're going to go ahead and extract that and extract here. I've already have it extracted, and then you're going to go ahead and extract your Benchy as well. All right, so we're going to and not don't do update only. You're going to go into new install. So these links that will link you to the folder no longer work because it's for 4.3 and these are all set to link to 4.0. So these folders don't work. Just want to show you that. So you're going to select these four folders, definitions, extruder, meshes, and quality changes. You're going to right click and copy those. From there, we're going to make your way to your C drive. We're going to go through the same um, path we went last time. Users, your profile you're logged into now, mine is Vulkan. Then we can go to app data, roaming, and then the cure folder right here and then 4.3 from there you'll right click and paste your profile now that it's pasted we can close everything out and we can go ahead and run cure again all right so now we're going to go and hit get started agree next and then right here, add a non-network printer. I'm gonna drop that down and we're gonna go to Monoprice. And it's the top one. Hit next. After you select the Monoprice Mini Delta and hit finish. And now it's here. Now let's go ahead and load our Benchy. good to go you can keep everything at its default settings then slice save and save yep. all right now that we have a save we're gonna make our way upstairs to the studio and get a printer the next step is go to your home screen select print go into your SD card select the file you save to it and the print will start up it's gonna bring itself down it's gonna tap the bill plate to calibrate it and the print will start and we'll see the results from there. All right, now that it's done, we're gonna get it removed. After going through the print and looking closer, I, I printed three of these. There is a problem with the bridging. I adjusted the settings a little bit but um, only improve minorly. So I guess we just dig into the settings a little bit more on the new cure. You could be able to fix this, but I went through three different ones. And I think a lot of it could be because I cranked the speed up 
to 2.0 manually on the printer because you can do that and that's probably why i had the problem with the bridging i didn't turn it off on any of them um, because i'm impatient but the prints came out pretty good even with me cranking it up to two times the speed it came out pretty good just the only problem like i said is with the bridging so um i play with the cure settings trying to fix it there to try to keep the speed but if you just print it on normal with the basic settings that you saw at first your print should come out just fine now another thing i actually want to show you guys is i suggest you you get a glass bill plate i've said these in my previous videos but it does really make a difference you can literally stop at like a hobby lobby or any type of arts and craft store and get a, a one of the mirrors from their shelves or any type of any glass they have over there but mirrors probably the best bet i ordered this on amazon it was only about 10 bucks i'll put the link in the description i use a little keftum tape to actually hold a 3d printed part a little better on the bottom because i feel like it shifted just slightly but i just wanted to be double secure and I'll include the link in the description as well for the 3D printed part to hold it on there. I went through four different types of uh, glass bed holding clips and this was the best one I came across. All right, folks, that is all for this video. Please like, share, and subscribe. Comment below if you have any questions and please check out the description for the Facebook group that you should be joining. There's a huge community of people out there with Monoprice Mini Deltas. Most of them have most likely come across the exact same problem that you are having and they're all willing to help. Everybody in the group is very friendly, so I suggest you join it. You pop a question on the wall and people are usually pretty speedy to respond to it and help you solve it. All right, folks, as always, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Later.